Um, okay, so many entrepreneurs kind of start off working out of their home, and then they bring on a brother or sis, a sibling, or maybe it's a <laughs> nephew or a niece. Um, but you also hear the story that you should never hire family. Um, right, right. But you are a testament that it works. So you've got many family members, as I know of, that work for you. Pinnacle. I do. Um, how have you managed to succeed there where people before you have not? You know, this is a very complicated <clears throat> topic. And I, I, I always have a disclaimer. I say, you know, I may not have all the right answers, but I do have an opinion. And my opinion is based on my personal experiences. I am very fortunate to have an incredible family that has a lot of talent, um, but that also my answer to your question is, we're all aligned on the beacon. We're all aligned on what we're trying to achieve. There is no personal argument that can get in the way of a larger legacy in what we're trying to achieve. Uh, the answer is respect. We respect each other and what we bring to the table. I have brought my husband, my brother, my cousin, my sister, my nephew into the business. And there are a lot of major large companies who have entrusted their family. And I would be lying if I told you that there was never a, a disagreement or there was ever um, a challenge. But I think those, the, 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 the beauty and the positiveness has outweighed those because wherever there's a challenge, it, the values have never unaligned. And so we're all very much aligned in the same direction. Mm -hmm.